will not see this until the new year so happy new year everyone 2024 up in the skull baby we starting the year off but strong okay it's the day after christmas but i'm not editing this until um exactly um <clears throat> my daddy bought me a google home y'all obsessed hey google Play 42 Doug, spin that back. Got it. Spin that back by 42 Doug. Playing on Spotify. <laughs> this for my thugs won't so hurt me in a minute. Like 10 M's coming when I get it, I'm splitty. Anyway, <laughs> Papa got me a Google um, and I'm obsessed. She's going to be mad at me because I'm going to hate Google her to death. Okay? But um, we got a laundry list of things that we need to do today. I need to, <clears throat> but it's currently raining. I didn't know it was supposed to rain today, but this Christmas decor is coming down. Tired of it. So I need to go to Dollar Tree and get some little bags so I can um, put all the little stuff on the trees in the bags uh, so I can get rid of the containers. Um, I need to go to the leasing office. And get my rental things straightened out. Because I don't know what the fuck they got going on. <sighs> I'm out of breath. Um, I need to go to find me some new gym shoes. I want to find some leggings. And there's some other stuff on my list. But I don't know where I put my phone. Hold on. first is I need to get an oil change that's the first thing I need to do um I was gonna get my car washed but it's raining so that's pointless um get bags of Christmas decor I'm gonna find some gym sneakers some leggings take down the Christmas decor and yeah and I want to go get a dome cap because I want to make a uh you part wig with my Alex Ivy bundles but that can wait I'm off all week it's just Tuesday so I want to run out of things to do for the week <laughs> But today, I definitely need to go get my oil change, go to the Dollar Tree, go to the leasing office, and I need to cook. So I probably need to go to the grocery store, too, and get some more water and some chicken and things of that nature. So let's go. We're back home, y'all. Oh, Aaron's on top of Aaron's, but I went to the Dollar Tree, got some... Um, gallon bags to put for two and a half gallon bags to put my stuff in i don't have tupperware container ain't that crazy and then i re-upped on my cleaning gloves two packs um another dollar tree i got some little bowls because i decided i wanted to make tuscan chicken and pasta tonight so how right babe then i went to the beauty supply i got a wig cap because I want to make my Alex Ivy bundle the toy you part. Got some more hair ties. Finally found my favorite edge control. This is my favorite edge control by the Tai Chi brand. And it don't turn white. Got another edge brush because mine is hard. And some more glue just in case. Then I went to... Sam's Club to pick up my protein shakes for my coffee. Then a jumbo bag of the snack food. Total snack. Then I went to Publix. I got me a little mini bottle of bread, some spinach, um, the sun dried tomatoes for, for the Tuscan pasta, some more garlic. Uh, two packs of chicken tendies. The poppies are buy one get one free at Food Leaks right now. So I got some of those. My favorite. These are my favorite flavors. Doc Pop. 
Doc Pop, Cherry Limeade, and Watermelon. Those are my two favorite flavors. And then five gallons of water. That's what I got. So I'm about to put this stuff up and get busy on taking down this Christmas tree because I'm tired of spinning. Good morning. It is currently Wednesday, December 27th. And as you can tell, I took down all my Christmas decor yesterday. It's gone. My apartment looks empty now, kinda. Like, it looks clean and just, ah, I'm obsessed with it. Um, but now that this corner is empty, I feel like I need to finally put some curtains in here. I don't know yet, but I'm getting ready to go to the gym. I'm starting off my new year now, so when y'all look at people cockeyed and say we in the way at the gym, I can say I was been in the gym since last year. I ain't in the way. I've been in the gym since the last year. <laughs> but y'all know I've been consistently inconsistent in the gym all 2023. But I'm really, 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 really trying to do my damnedest to be consistent with it in 2024. Not consistently inconsistent, but consistent. I'm talking about consistency throughout. So I'm getting ready to go to the gym. I just made my protein coffee. Um, I used the Premier Protein in Caramel and the, um, hold on, let me get it, and the Busy Decaf Cold Brew. I live for this because when I say zeros down the board, zeros down the board. So, it gives me my coffee taste without the caffeine overdose. So, I need to go to the gym today. I also need to go to TJ Maxx because I'm out of my Tarani syrups. Um, I need to go find me some new gym shoes. And I also need to go to Target to get some more body wash and stuff. So, those are the plans for today. And I'm going to try to get it all done at once. And I also need a new memory card. So, I definitely need to go do that today because I only got two minutes left on here. Mm, right. Hey, you all. I'm back from the gym. I've been doing a little too much shopping the last couple days, but I'm officially done. I'm not by myself and not another Christmas gift, not another I made it to the end of the year gift. This is it for purchases in 2023. And then next year, like I said, I'm setting myself a budget per month to buy me something nice. Because I got I, 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 I to gotta go buy me a car. Okay, I gotta buy me a car. I gotta pay some things down, get rid of some things. So this is my last week purchasing things. I'm still waiting on my Amazon order to come in. My Uggs are supposed to be here today. My Adidas and my New Balance. So I've ordered, I've gotten five pairs of shoes in the last week. I really went into Famous Footwear to find some new gym shoes, but they didn't have any black and white ones that I like. So I ended up getting two other pair of shoes. I got these cute little Nike waffle something. Debut vintage in muslin. In muslin and campfire orange. I think these are so stinky cute. I love Nike waffles. I have some other ones, uh, but they're like more mesh. But I think these are so, super cute. I need like a neutral pair of sneakers. Then I got another pair of shoes. This is that famous footwear in store. And these are the Nike Initiators in white cherry and metallic silver. Y'all, these shoes are so sticky cute. <laughs> they are so sticky. I finally found my little mall walkers. They're not the New Balance or the A6. I didn't know Nike had them, and these are so cute. I tried them on in store, and I'm obsessed with the pink, and they're cozy. I could slick wear these to the gym too, but <sighs> tell me these aren't cute. Tell me these aren't cute. These are the Nike initiators. These were. $74.99 and the other shoes was $79.99. I probably could have got, why would them cost more? I don't know, but 
those are the two pair of shoes that I picked up today. And then I'm still waiting on the other three pair of shoes. The Uggs should have been here by now. But they haven't got here. Hopefully I like them. And I got the receipts for everything. I tried these on so I know these are a keep. I ordered the Sambas. I think I ordered my New Balances in the wrong size. So those may very well be going back. I um, Oh, I also picked up my nails. Y'all not buying nothing else. I promise y'all I'm not. If anything, I'll be sending some stuff back. Of course, it's 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 time to do the nails it's been three weeks so i picked up my favorite nails and then i picked up these cute little neutral pink type nails too and i think i'm gonna wear these i'm gonna do these this week and then i got my trusty dusty set so no more spending i'm done i gotta pay these credit cards and everything in between so yeah, I'm done. My Uggs came in the mail. Now let's see if I actually like them. I like Urban Outfitters little bubble melon. These, and I got them in the size eight. Ooh, these look like boats. I got the platform joints. Let's try them on. Is this still short? I feel like I'm breaking ankle in me. I forgot to tell y'all, I'm sending them back. You probably can't see me. I'm sending them back. I just don't like the ankle to boot ratio. It's, it's a little off and I don't like my ankles rocking the boat. So I'm gonna send these back and just get regular Uggs. I tried, but I'm just gonna get regular Uggs. It's dark. Um, Y'all, it is December 30th, and it's time to black people clean this house. Top to bottom. That's laundry, dishes, everything. We don't go into the new year with a dirty house. We don't. And my house is looking crazy. Like, she's, she's looking crazy. So, I have to run to the store really quickly because I need some more detergent. All of my washing supplies need to be replenished. So I'm getting ready to go to Target to get that. Um, and I don't know what I'm going to cook for dinner. I don't know what I'm going to cook for dinner for tonight or tomorrow, honestly. But I'm tired of eating out. So, well, I only ate out once this week. But anywho, so, oh, dang, ugh. I broke my <laughs> So we're about to go run these quick errands, hit target real quick. Um, I put in a maintenance request because I feel like something electrical is going on in here with these lights because they're flickering. Every time I turn a light on, one is flickering. Like that one was flickering this morning. The one in the kitchen still be flickering. My lamp be flickering. And now one in the bathroom is flickering. So I, I think we have a problem here. So I put in a maintenance, maintenance request. They probably won't come in the next week, but that's good because I want to be home so I can explain what is going on. Um, but yeah, let's run these errands. It's currently 1022. Run these errands, get back home, and start because we got to wipe down everything. Okay? The laundry, putting it up, literally everything needs to be done. So let's go. I don't know what I call myself shooting today, baby, because it ain't no footage. I cooked dinner. Um, she looking kind of bland now, but I made a Tuscan 
pasta, garlic bread. I already ate. Now I'm going to make me a drinky drink. I was gonna make a French 75, but I don't like gin and I don't like champagne. So we're gonna make a lemon drop with Prosecco on top. Mm -hmm. So I'm about to make that right now and show y'all what you need. So first off, I kind of want to lose, I'm gonna use a wine glass so we can get more background. But the dishes, like do I need to wash them before 12 o'clock? I think I do. So things you need, lemon juice. Um, I think I'm gonna go tequila. We gonna go Luna Azul. Tequila and Prosecco. Yeah, let's do that. We're gonna do, I know I got some Terry, some Terry Mana in here. We're gonna do Luna Azul, lemon juice, simple syrup, light, light. And then I got this Mignonetta. Well, I don't know what it's called. Prosecco, a little small bottle. Um, yeah, so this is literally all you need to make a lemon drop. So let's get into it. I'm gonna put y'all right here. We're gonna do a shot and a half. Because why not, right? Then we're gonna do simple syrup. I got some triple sick too. A half a shot of simple sugar. Then our lemon juice. We're gonna do a shot, a full shot of lemon juice. And here. And you gotta make sure you don't shake your champagne with the rest of the drink because it will or your Prosecco. Cheers to 2024. New adventures, a bigger bag, and all of the above. Cheers. Let's do a taste test. Yes. Mm-hmm. I cannot believe it, y'all. We're going into a new year. And I've been blessed to enjoy 2023 to its entirety. And I'm so excited to see what 2024 has in store. We are upgrading our lives this year. I got the green light from the Lord to push the gas, baby. All gas, no what? Brakes. So cheers. To each and every one of you, I hope you have a blessed, fruitful, loving, and peaceful 2024. And I'm so excited for y'all to go on this journey with me. Because what? Cheers to all of you. Happy New Year. Y'all, I'm struggling so bad to stay awake. It is currently 11.09. I did not buy any grapes. I'm just gonna pray. I pre-jotted down a list of 12 things uh, alongside my mold board that are a little bit more detailed for me uh, that I'm gonna go into the new year with because I didn't get the grapes. So yeah, it's 11.09. I'm trying my damnedest to stay up to 12 o'clock. 
But mama's is old. I'm not old, but I'm tired. I've been up since seven. My usual bedtime is like nine o'clock. 8.45 on a good day. <laughs> so I am beat with a stick. So that's that. But yeah, I'm trying to stay up. I'm listening to fireworks, watching a little TV, trying to figure out why I ordered something from Urban almost a month ago and still haven't received it. So I'm on the chat line with them because it just geared to my head that I'm missing a package. It's 2024 and I'm missing a package. So I'm on the chat with them right now to see where the hell my shit is at. So we'll see, but I'm staying up. I'm trying. Just like my body is shutting down, so I didn't go to the gym. But weirdest thing, I get a uh, code from my package locker saying that I got a package. I haven't bought anything, and I don't know who sent it or where it came from. But it's a uh, glasses towel. I promise you I ain't ordered. It's a glasses tower. Like a display for the sunglasses. I don't I don't know who it's thinking. But it got my name, my address, my apartment number. I mean, it's a full-fledged glass tower. Glasses tower. I don't, I checked my Amazon like, did I order something on accident? I didn't order anything. I called my mom, cause she good for <laughs> purchasing stuff and then sending it to my house on accident. But none of my cards are charged. 
check that. It's a little weird. It's a little weird, but could I use it? Absolutely. Absolutely. freaking I mean, let me put it together and show y'all. I don't know what to do. Should I? I can't call Amazon. I can't ask them, like, is this a gift for me from y'all? Like, I don't, I don't know what to do. I know none of my friends sent me nothing, so I'm confused. But it's super cute. It makes me wonder because who got my address? It makes me wonder. I did not order this. Just don't know if I should be scared or what, but I Y'all, I'm feeling so much better today. I took me some meds. I don't have a cold, but something yesterday just took over my body where I was crashing. But I feel so much better today. So I'm going to the gym at 12 o'clock, like I'm supposed to, <laughs> to stay in, in my routine. So I've been going to the gym at 12 o'clock for lunch. Um, instead of taking a nap <laughs> for lunch. Because I work from home so I can eat while I'm on the clock because the kitchen is near the desk. But um, where I usually eat near the couch, but I'm trying to get up and move um, for lunch versus laying down or just aimlessly scrolling. So we're going to the gym. I need some new gym clothes. Uh, but I got my little green leggings on. This little sweater, I always wear a gold necklace because it makes me pop at the gym. And then we're gonna put on our Nikes. It's upper body day and cardio. So, shouldn't take me long. I should be in and out um, in no time. So, yeah, let's go to the gym. Y'all, I really, I'm watching some YouTubers and I know I do not have space to even think about doing such malarkey but i really want to get those shelves that they get from target and that literally makes no sense like this is my closet y'all are on the other wall that would make no sense for me to do but i just need some space like i have this one in here right now um and I really want to take it out because it does take up some space. But I don't know what I would do without it. So, that's physically not responsible for me to get one of those bookshelves. There's literally, my closet is a box. But I'm just trying to figure out more space and using it. Here go these lights flickering again. And using it wisely. See, this light never flickered. Now it's flickering. And they told me yesterday it wasn't no problem. It's a problem. But what pissed me off the most is when they came, the lights didn't flicker at all. Now they flickering. Anywho, so um, that's what I want to do. But I got storage. I got the shelf. I mean the drawers. I just got to finish. And as you can see, I really didn't feel yesterday, well yesterday because I left all of this stuff on the floor. But when I get back from the gym, I literally toss it off the bed put it on the floor. But when I get back from the gym, I'm going to um, finish up and get my room and life organized. So let's go to the gym and get our sweat away. I am, why does it do that? I think it's, oh, anyway, I'm back home from the gym. I'm about to make my salad. Um, I went to Publix to get a rotisserie chicken, but they said they didn't make them today. Like, what do you mean? Y'all don't make them every day? So I had to stop at Chick-fil-A. I'm still not doing fried foods. But I needed some protein, so 
I got a uh, 12 carat of their, um, what you call it, their grill nuggets to put on top of my Caesar salad because I need to go grocery shopping. I could have did that at Publix while I was there, but I didn't want to aimlessly spin. So, yeah, and then these little salad packs are my favorite. The Taylor's Farm and the Fresh Express, but I don't know why they think it's three servings. Like, who's gonna only eat chopper? I'm about to devour this entire salad. So, this is my lunch for today. Then I'm going to probably shower and not probably. I'm gonna go shower and then clean up my house in that room because, whew, and we need to end this vlog because it's it's. It's stretching. It's stretching. Okay, we are showered. We're somewhat recovered. That class kicked my ass. That ass was kicked. But now it's time to go grocery shopping. I don't know if I told y'all, but I'm going to try the 6-1 method. This video is getting longer and longer. I promise I'm going to end it after I go grocery shopping. But I'm going to try the 6-1 method. And basically, it's getting six veggies, five fruits, four proteins, three carbs, two sauces, and one fun item. So I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's and see if I can do this and be under $100. So we're gonna go see. Um, I really wanna go to the farmer's market because I know I really be under 100 to get like my fruits and veggies. I don't feel like going to places. It's rainy. It's cold. So, I don't know. Do I feel like going to places? <sighs> Both of them are going to be crowded. I feel like I could get everything from Trader Joe's, but veggies and fruits at the farmers is just so much cheaper. But I have to get my protein and carbs and things at another store. I just don't feel like going to two different stores. So, that's that. We're bumming it. Um... I'm gonna put on my jacket. This is the fit check. I'm listening. We're bumming it. It's cold outside. But I'm gonna put on my green jacket. I need some more sweatpants. I like longer sweatpants, and these are just not long enough for me. Like, but oh, y'all can't even see them. But these little sweatpants are from Target. This little shirt, HM. This is pretty little thing. And I'm gonna go put on my jacket. These are my shoes. It's all in the details. It's all in the details. Like the pants are so short. I don't know. But let's go. We are back home. Light still flickering. But whoever said it was cheaper to do it this way, your mom's a hoe. Because you lied. I spent $91. Everybody on TikTok talking about this is You're lying. So, this is the 6-in-1 method. So, this is my one fun item. My trail mix. My two sauces were sriracha and the spicy honey. I want to try that. My cards were these tortillas. Oh, well, I bought three fun items because these smack I'm about to have one with my food I bought apples oranges limes lemons um, sweet potatoes something had a bug in it this is a bug in my bag I don't know what it was, but something had a bug in it. Um, oh, my red onion. I have my back turned towards y'all. I'm sorry. I'm just ready to eat. Should have went to the farmer's market, but I got three cucumbers, spinach, parsley, string beans, of course, Brussels sprouts, rice as a carb my raviolis as a carb so i got rice tortillas in my raviolis 
my proteins i got salmon chicken ground turkey and egg whites so these are my groceries <laughs> now what type of meal i'm gonna cook with i don't know but these are my groceries. so yeah now i'm about to put this up and eat because i have yet to eat today all i had was a protein shake and it's three o'clock and of course, I went to get Kylo. But y'all, this is the end of this video. I need to cut the BS because I just keep adding clips. Clips. But thank y'all so much for tuning into my video. Happy New Year. The first full week is done. And I need to get back in my bag. I ain't been feeling inspired lately. Did all that planning to do nothing that I planned. But that's okay. It's still early. It's still early. So yeah, thank y'all for tuning into my video. Make sure you tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. Come rock with your girl. Anywho, bye you all.